As we near the end of term three, it's time to look back and celebrate the many activities and events that have been going on across the college. A major highlight was our production, Mary Poppins, which played to three packs out shows at the Plenty Rangers Theatre. Our students, parents and community were wowed by the performances from over 40 students from year four up to year 12. A massive thank you to all of the staff who work over many months to make this production possible. Book week is always a fun time and the dress up day showed an immense amount of effort from students and parents. The primary year's book week parade was really well supported by parents and the students loved seeing each other's costumes. We had a visit from our local MP, Lauren Cathage, who presented several awards and donated books to the college. It was a great way to promote the Premier's Reading Challenge that so many of our primary year students participate in. Year four students have enjoyed an exciting camp to Lady Northcote in Bacchus Marsh, and our year three students have just returned from a fantastic camp to Phillip Island. The famous giant swing, flying fox and canoeing were some of the daytime activities, along with the disco at night. In addition, Year 5 students enjoyed exploring the history of the goldfields with an overnight trip to Ballarat. Our prep students have looked fantastic, dressed up as old people as they celebrated the milestone that is 100 days of school. Our Year 4 students have proudly invited their parents to attend and view their projects at their Down to Earth iDiscover Expo. It was fantastic to see so much effort and research that was put into the dioramas, posters, workbooks and their presentations. A massive congratulations to all of the primary year students and teachers for their fantastic house performing arts performances. There was certainly a fantastic buzz and all of the performances were outstanding with really great singing, dancing and acting displays. A big thank you to all of the parents who came to support as well as helping to provide the costumes and colours for our students. Our annual Father's Day breakfast had a great turnout and many of our dads enjoyed an amazing breakfast with their kids. The Father's Day stall was another busy day of sales with support from our Student Leadership Academy who were helping out to service this. Our Year 9 students have continued their study of community as part of their experiential learning. They've been heading into the city on several excursions and they've had visits to the new uh, the Queen Vic Market and the Indigenous Walk along Birrung Mar. Back at school, the Great Tech Challenge allowed learning on cyber safety, artificial intelligence and gearing up for the future world. Our Year 10 students dressed up with everyone looking very elegant and sophisticated as they enjoyed partying the night away at their Year 10 formal. Well done to everyone who attended, it was certainly a great night. Our senior school students have been busy picking up their subjects for next year and undertaking their pathway meetings. Whilst Year 12 are busy completing their Unit 4 studies in preparation for their final weeks of school early next term. I wish everyone a relaxing spring break holiday and I look forward to seeing everyone refreshed for the start of term four.